Hello, hello, hello. Time yes to roll. Okay, baby, we're going to do a karmic check-in. Welcome, welcome, welcome. If you're new here, hunties, welcome back. If you are returning, Why I missed you, my love. So we're going to see what's going on with the karmic that's dealing with your divine masculine at this time. What is going on with the karmic dealing with the divine masculine? They can um, still be in conversation, communication. They can still be dealing with each other. Divine master could have walked away already, okay? Um, we're going to see what's going on with them in this connection. What's going on between the divine master and the karmic at this time? Where's the karmic's energy at when it comes to this divine masculine? What is the situation between the divine masculine and this karmic energy? Okay, so let's see what's going on. Name of the mother, the father, the son, and the Holy Spirit. Okay, so what we need to know right now for the greatest and highest good when it comes to this divine masculine and the karmic that they're dealing with. Okay. So this karmic is stalking, watching, following you, and they got their friends stalking, watching, and following you, okay? And these motherfuckers is fake as shit. And the crazy thing is, this motherfucker is watching, stalking, and following you. They got their friends following and watching them. And these motherfuckers is fake friends to their asses. These friends don't really like their ass either. Fake as shit. Yeah, this is the other woman, for sure. Um, it could be another man. Lipstick stains is always my other woman card. So, um, they may feel like you the other woman, Divine Femme. So, they watching and stalking. Yeah, they could be doing money spells because they're materialistic here. They could be trying to do money spells. Or they may feel like you're doing money spells. I feel like this person is doing money spells to stop your money because they see you out here buying shit, got your shit going up here. Yeah, they're trying to figure out who the fuck you are because you out here shining. Your money looking good. You're doing good. Yeah, this karmic ass energy, you want to know who the fuck you are because they're... You're, <laughs> They person, your person is walking away from this connection. They're ending this connection for you. What's going on with this karmic, divine masculine's karmic? Yeah, it's more than one. So, um, divine masculine may have had several karmic energies. That was confirmation. Um, Or they've, they've gotten several people to help them do these spells to block your money here. Because they're trying to stop you from buying. They see you out here coming up. They, they see you shining out here. Okay? Flossing the, 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 the bags. Even if you're not materialistic, like you don't like name brand stuff, you still can go anywhere and buy whatever you want. Okay? You, you're not scraping up nothing. If you, if you want to get up and go, you can get up and go. You know what I'm saying? Like, your money is good. You're good. And these motherfuckers is doing spells to try to bind your shit up. So this motherfucker, this your person, your divine masculine. Yep, this could be their baby mama. Baby mama, baby daddy. Somebody lied about being pregnant. Karmic ass energy of X. Okay? But this motherfucker is uh mad because you out here doing the shit. They're jealous. They're envious. Now they didn't got their friends and shit. Yeah, you getting whatever you want. You can just go buy whatever you want. Money's not an issue for you, Divine Femme. And they're mad about it. So they figure if they block your money, maybe your person won't come towards you. Yes, another woman. So yeah, there's another feminine out, uh, energy out here. And they're constantly in comparison with you. This is your divine masculine's other person. Yeah, this karmic is trying to fix it with their divine with the divine masculine energy here, okay? They they said let's get counseling. Um, if they were married, if they were married, this person is actually getting a divorce, okay? Um, if they were just in a connection, you know, baby mama, baby daddy, or boyfriend, girlfriend, long term connection, whatever that is. This person is like, can we eat, can we at least get some type of counseling? Can we try to make it work? This karmic is trying to get counseling. And they're doing background checks on you. They feel like you the other woman.
Sorry, y'all. Y'all know the kids is out of school right now, so maybe a few stops in between. Yeah, they, they may feel like you're the other woman. And they even got their friends together. So they're doing background checks on you here. Um, this could be a man. If you're a man watching, you could be the man. Okay? Um, but they're trying to figure out who the fuck you are. And they're trying to... they watching you. Social media. Trying, trying to find out <laughs> where the hell you came from. And how you getting your money. Yeah, it may be somebody you know. <laughs> this may be somebody you know. That's trying to stop your connections. And trying to stop your money. And they're, they're recruiting other people. They're recruiting other people here. Yeah, this is somebody that you blocked on social media. Yes, for some of you guys, this is somebody you're no longer having sex with. So this, there's several energies here, y'all, okay? So this could be a friend, an ex-friend. This could be um your person, Divine Masculine's ex. Because I'm picking up on a lot of karmic energy here, y'all, okay? Um, because it says it's more than one. This could be a, I said a friend, an ex friend, a family member, a homegirl, a homeboy. This could be somebody that you know close, somebody you work with. This could be this could be your person's ex, yeah. But they all over it. They over it. Whatever they've been doing, these money spells to try to block it. Yeah, they constantly gossiping and talking about you. But they're over it. Nothing is working. They're jealous of your connection. Yeah. They've been going to this witch, witch or high priestess. They may even think you're a witch or high priestess. Yeah, they've been doing love spells. This person been doing love spells. Yep, <laughs> they feel like you may be doing spells too here because you get anything that you want. But I, I, I don't feel like you're doing any spells. I just feel like you're getting good karma for the shit that you do here, collective. Yeah, whoever these karmics are, they need a job. They need a job. <laughs> And they're mad, yeah, and they're mad because you're not interested in sex with them because they broke. Or they don't have no hustle about them. And you're not dealing with nobody that ain't got no hustle. Yeah, whoever this is, they want to reach out and talk to you. It's several karmics here, y'all. They need a job. It's another woman, a high priestess. Yeah, somebody could be going to a high priestess, paying a high priestess to do these spells on you. This could be the ex. Your ex, your person ex. Yeah, whoever this is, they have some type of persuasion drug habit here. And they're a nightlife groupie. They like to hang out and party all the time. Pop drugs, pop pills. You know, do the bullshit. What's going on with this karmic ass energy here? Yeah, they mad because you out here doing your own shit. You your own boss here. Collective. Even if you um you work for somebody, you doing your shit. You know what I'm saying? You you doing your shit. If you got your own business, you doing your shit. If you do something online, they watching you. They they stalking and watching everything you do. You may do some type of counseling online. They listening, getting advice from you, and, and in the same time, talking shit about you. What kind of bullshit is that? They getting motherfucking counseling on their motherfucking connections while they watching you online and <laughs> want to talk shit about you. Name of the mother, the father, the son, and the Holy Spirit. Okay, what's going on with Divine Masculine as Karmics? Yeah, this Divine, um, this Karmic got shocked by this Divine Masculine. They in shock right now that this Divine Masculine is really ending it. What else is going on with this Karmic when it comes to this Divine Masculine? Yeah, this, <laughs> they, they have been pretending to be very busy. Or this Divine Masculine has been very busy not answering their calls, not checking in. Okay. They could be looking. This also could be them checking to see what you be doing for work. <laughs> Why you so busy? You busy because you working. That's <laughs> some bullshit. Yeah, they in a shock because you making all this money, but you actually doing it. Yeah, they could have tried to stop a connection with your a new man, and they trying to stop your money. They shocked. This karmic, these karmics are shocked that your money is looking like this and... You got this new connection, this divine master and divine fam. What else is going on with this karmic here when it comes to the divine masculine? They still want to work on the relationship with this divine masculine. They still want to work on the relationship, and they're sad because it's over. And divine masculine has blocked them. Yeah, 
Yeah. They do not like the decisions that this divine masculine has made. And they're upset. Yeah, they're trying to escape. They're smoking, doing whatever kind of drug they do. Smoking, drinking. It says escaping. They're doing whatever they do to escape. They're trying to escape right now. Yeah, they're mad because this divine masculine told they asked it, it ain't none of their business who they date. And they finna go date divine femme here. And this karmic is losing their mind because it has to be over. And they blocked them. Yeah. This this karmic is thinking about the past. They remember in the past. They remember what went down, how shit happened. Anything else when it comes to this karmic and this connection here? The divine masculine. Yeah. They know Divine Masculine don't trust them anymore. Divine Masculine don't trust them as far as they can see him. Yeah, because this motherfucker always out there partying and shit. Out here drinking, hanging out, smoking, getting drunk, fucking with motherfuckers at work. Okay? Lied about her pregnancy, trying to trap their asses. They was a fucking con artist. Okay? The, th they was, the third party was a fucking con artist. And this is why they good. They they good. Because the karmic tried to con them to, saying that they're pregnant. I don't know if you can see it, but she's pregnant in this picture. To trap them. They tried to trap them. And, and now this karmic is thinking about what they did. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and that the whole time the relationship was just a one-sided relationship. Okay? Yeah. <laughs> Now, this karmic's best friend could be telling them, you know your worth, you deserve better than this. It's time to move forward. Or this could be divine masculine. Yeah. Divine masculine telling, um, divine masculine people telling him to move forward. He deserved better than this karmic. Anything else when it comes to this karmic and this divine masculine here, spirit? Okay, I'll grab that deck over there. Female or the male? Both. Okay. 12.22 on the clock, y'all. What's going on when it comes to the karmic towards this divine masculine? Yeah, this karmic could have been a stripper or into strippers. Yeah, they mad at the decisions and choices that they made. They're feeling stupid right now about the choices and decisions that they made. Yeah, because they know that divine masculine was a good man. And they fucked it off. This karmic fucked it off with divine masculine. They knew divine masculine was a good man or a good woman. Yeah. Um, Spirit says you are protected, but they, this, this good man was protected from their harm and the choices and decisions that they made. This the divine master was protected, and so are you, Empress. Okay, don't try to play me. I know my worth in that order. Yeah, so whatever this karmic has been sending towards you, divine fam and divine master, you guys are protected. You guys are protected. Now this karmic is dealing with the choices and the decisions that they made. Consequences for the choices and decisions that they made. Yeah, they're mad because um, Divine Femme, you out here staying positive. You're working hard and you're making it happen. That's why these motherfuckers is hating. They not happy at all. Celebration in reverse. Yeah, they sitting around with their friends. Look, third party. The third party is not happy at all. They sitting around with their motherfucking friends. Spying on you on social media. Drinking, smoking, and talking shit. Sad as shit. Because divine messengers walked away from their motherfucking asses. Yeah. And divine femme, you over here meditating and raising your vibration in this bitch. And they mad. They mad because you elevating. They mad because you positive and you work hard. And you make shit happen. They mad because you, you a boss. And you living that boss life. And they mad because everything they keep trying to send towards you, you're protected. And they mad because you finna get the good man or the good woman. Because you are the empress or the emperor. Anything else when it comes to this karmic towards this divine master? Anything else when it comes to the karmic? You tell me the other decks. Let me see. Yeah, they're mad because this divine master is coming to be with you, divine film. Because this divine master told them that being in your arms feel like home. Okay? It, they feel safe with you. And it triggered this motherfucker. So now this karmic is spying because there's something about you that triggers them. They can't stop watching you. They can't stop looking at you because you trigger the shit out their asses. Because you what they want to be. Okay? These copycat want to be bitches. <laughs> or men. Yeah. Okay.
Okay, what's going on with the karmic when it comes to this divine masculine? What's going on with the, the karmic when it comes to the divine masculine? We do need it to jump. Yeah, y'all being cursed, honeys. This karma is going through some type of ancestor curse. Your, your ancestors told these bitches and they little crew to stop playing. Told these men and they little crew to stop playing. They, they fucking around and finna get cursed. This motherfucker tried to do some type of magic. Tracking their period to trap them with a baby. They tried to trap them with a baby and now they finna be cursed for that bullshit. For doing that stupid ass magic. What else is going on with this karma? Yep. Out here liking, licking, and loving it on everybody. Now they finna get... Exactly what they deserve. What else is going on with this karma when it comes to divine masculine? Yeah, I told you there was a copycat want to be you, bitch. I can't make that shit up. I just said it. This karma is a copycat want to be you, divine fan. They tried to track their period to get pregnant by your divine masculine, and that shit didn't work. Now they mad because your divine masculine told them I'm going home. Divine fan is home, and they're triggered. They're triggered. they triggered like a motherfucker. Yeah, and they feel like you competition. They feel like you the other woman. You competition. Or the other man. Yeah. They now realizing that they was just sex and nothing more. And it's fucking them up. Because they thought you was just sex and nothing more. But this divine master is coming for you because they love you. Look, hey, look it up. They're going to divine macro right there. They thought you was just, they thought you was the one that was just sex and nothing more. And divine master that fooled that ass. So I'm like, uh, uh I'm going to my divine fam. <laughs> I realize you just a copycat wannabe bitch. You ain't even the real shit. You a fake and a fraud. A fake and a fucking fraud. Now this bitch is over there playing victim. Because the bitch ain't pregnant. The bitch playing like she lost the baby. The bitch ain't pregnant. Acting as if the world owe you something. Don't nobody owe you shit. Karmic ass. Copycat wannabe bitch. You got your motherfucking friends out here stalking. You inconspicuous sleep, bitch. You don't even know who you are. Dysfunctional. Doing beauty spells. You did, did beauty spells on Divine Fem. Yeah, mattress back home. And the friends. All that shit you did towards this Divine Fem is coming back. The spell work. Yeah, all that shit's coming back. The cloud, the judgment of Divine Fem and Divine Master. Yeah, that she devil can't see it clearly. Yeah, your judgment finna be clouded. Because you got this ancestor's curse coming for that ass. Karma coming for that ass. Tell me more about this karmic energy dealing with divine masculine. So if your um, divine masculine is a woman, this is the man deck. So like as you see, this came out with woman's side. So we'll see if you're, if you're dealing with a woman, okay? So what's going on with this karmic energy? When it comes to this divine masculine. Tell me about the karmics. The male karmics dealing with divine masculine. The male karmics dealing with divine masculine. The male karmics dealing with divine masculine. Divine masculine can't be a woman, babies, okay? So male karmics dealing with divine masculine. Clarify. What's going on with this karmic dealing with this divine masculine? Another damn baby. So this divine masculine, they got somebody else pregnant. So if you are, um, or they got pregnant by somebody else. So if you're the man and you're dealing with a a, a, a woman that's a divine masculine, they got pregnant by somebody. Okay? This karmic energy got pregnant by somebody. Yep, they two-faced it too. Wishy-washy. Yep. Oh, baby, can I have it raw? So somebody fucked around. This man fucked around. Had sex raw with somebody and it got him pregnant. This motherfucker's two-faced it. Karmic ass man. Tell me more about these karmic ass men. They all up in their head because they know they fucked up. So if you're dealing with a karmic man, right? This karmic man fucked around and had a, got pregnant or got somebody else pregnant on your woman, okay? They switched up on your woman. They had sex with somebody um, 
on your woman here on your on your um divine film and they got that third party pregnant and now they feeling stupid because they got the third party pregnant tell me more what's going on with this male car yeah now they're watching investigating putting their nose all up in someone else's business so this man is watching your divine film from from the background I hope y'all still follow him, okay? Hit <laughs> this karmic ass energy if it's a man. Yeah, this motherfucker fake too. This motherfucker got a bunch of fake ass friends watching and looking as well. Tell me more about <laughs> the karmic, the man karmic dealing with divine, I mean divine masculine. Yeah, so whoever this man karmic is, they are having some type of mental health concerns, okay? Because they done fucked around and got somebody pregnant. Another damn baby. Now they all up in their head and they don't know what the fuck to do because they done fucked up now. What else is going on with this Kermit? Yeah. The people that they hurt want their heads now. So they've hurt several people. And now all these people that they've hurt. Yeah, spirits, just keep your distance from this karmic ass man. Please keep your distance. Fuck boy, fuck girl alert. So I do feel like um, your person... Walked away from this karmic ass man because they was a fuck boy or a fuck girl. They fucked around and got some outside third party pregnant. Okay, this motherfucker was two faced and a switch up artist, and out here having sex with everybody without no condom, right? So your person walked away from this person. Now your person, now this karmic ass energy is all up in their head and fucked up about the shit they did. Now they're sitting here watching you. Okay, now they're watching you. And they all up in their head with these mental health concerns for the shit they've done to hurt people. If this is a man, they could have been molested as a child. They could um, have some, some issues they need to deal with here. Anything else about that karmic man? Yeah, that karmic man good at playing fucking victim too. Good at playing fucking victim too. Yeah, they're a liar too. So the karmic man is a liar, good at playing victim. Anything else about the karmic man here, spirits, they need to know. Yeah, this is your ex, okay? This your motherfucking ex collective. You walked away from this motherfucker, guess what? You walked away from this motherfucker, this motherfucker put you in a third party, they fucked you around and got somebody pregnant. Spirit says the best thing for you to do was to walk away from this person. Keep your distance from this person. This motherfucker's two-faced, okay? They run around fucking everybody without no condom, Okay? They done fucked around, got somebody else pregnant. They got these fake ass friends. Them and they fake ass friends is watching you. Okay? This person has some mental health issues here. And now they they running around because it's a bunch of people that want to want their head because they didn't dog motherfuckers out. And and they good at playing victim. Like they the ones that uh been hurt when in all actuality, they the ones going around hurting motherfuckers because they're a liar. Spirit says, fuck your ex. Tell the haters I said fuck my ex. Yes, yeah, your ex. Yeah, now they feeling neglected and shit. Yeah, this motherfucker got some type of STD, STI indicated too. So if you got a man karmic, don't fuck with him. He got some type of ST, uh, STD, STI indicated. And this motherfucker's a physical abuser. And this motherfucker go around dicking cougars down for money. So they fuck with old, <laughs> old women for money. Now they got a bunch of regrets and shit. This motherfucker avoid contact. They sick. Avoid contact with six motherfucking people. Now they sitting back watching angry behind the scenes. Because this motherfucker's committed to the streets. Spirit says the same shit different day with this motherfucker. They's a drunk bitch. They's a drunk bitch. Okay? There's a motherfucking drunk bitch. Spirit says this motherfucker thought the grass was greener on the other side. They got a taste of their own goddamn medicine. They went fucking around and got them a motherfucking toxic ass stripper. A toxic ass motherfucking stripper. And this bitch is pregnant. This motherfucker is feeling donkey of the motherfucking day for the decisions they, they made because now they healing from the fucking STD that the motherfucking toxic ass stripper gave they motherfucking asses. They over here spending their money unwisely and shit on paying for motherfucking strippers and shit. That's why they always broke, can't even pay their fucking rent. Spirit says they receiving karma because they's a sneaky bitch and they got sex addictions, but these motherfuckers got caught cheating. Now they don't know what to say. This motherfucker needs to see some goddamn therapy. This motherfucker's throwing fake love straight up to your face. Narcissistic ass behaviors. And this motherfucker got too many bodies to count. They got caught cheating online. Yeah. Now they submerged with guilt for what they did to the people. Shh. Told you they must have been molested. Came out twice. 
They may go both ways, y'all, okay? Um, they may be hiding. They may be in the closet, undercover. It ain't popped out yet. There's a card in here that say gay for pay. Um, in my face, you bay. Behind my back, you everyone's bay. Yeah. Damn, get your face off the fucking phone. This motherfucker always in the phone looking for the next victim. Looking for the next target. Yeah, you walked away from this person. You was done. Yeah, this motherfucker was a manipulator. They tracking your every moves and watching. They had a bunch of fake ass gratitude and they was a motherfucking switch, switch up artist. Now they running away from the truth. And Spirit said this motherfucker was not a lover. They was a loser. This motherfucker online dating for money. They finna go to jail. Or they finna be locked up. Okay? Because they got these fucking unhealthy habits. Yep. And Spirit said they too goddamn old to be playing these childish ass games. They need to grow the fuck up. Oh, there we go. Told you. I'm claws and sneaky. Ashamed I like penis too. Because they got molested as a kid. They don't even know who the fuck they are. They guarded. They need to let they guard down. They mad because you got them blocked. Yeah, but they running for multiple lovers because they have some kind of STD. Okay, babies. I'm going to leave this karmic read here. So, all these motherfuckers are stalking and following. They got their friends. If you got a women, they stalking and following. These motherfuckers' exes are stalking and following. If you're dealing with a man, your exes... It's following, stalking, sending hate. Baby, y'all protected. Just know these karmics want to be you. And they see you out here doing it. You keep doing what you're doing. They let you know you're on the right page because you got a motherfucking fan club, mom. <laughs> and they mad because they was just nothing but sex. Just sex and nothing more. Truth is a motherfucker. You keep meditating, okay? I have to meditate and raise my vibration in this bitch. You keep meditating and raising your vibration on these hoes. Yeah, because these motherfuckers are just a bunch of drunk bitches, okay? A bunch of drunk bitches that constantly can't do nothing but spy because you trigger them. Because you trigger them. You show them the insecurities they have within themselves, okay? You ain't did nothing to them but <laughs> made them have to look at themselves and they don't like what the fuck they see. That's their fault. They ain't got shit to do with you. Nothing to do with you. These motherfuckers need to go sit some, down somewhere and heal from them STDs. Spirit said it. And if it's not a sexually transmitted disease, you got some spiritually transmitted diseases on you. You got some demons, some succubus, some incubus, some Jezebel energy all up on your ass. Go sit your ass down and heal. Damn. Okay, until next time, my babies. You keep rocking with me. I'm going to keep rocking with you. Love, light, and peace. Mwah! Bye, my TT babies.